Hello, masters and princesses. This is Peter from MNN. ご主人様、お嬢様、お元気ですか。今日の福岡のお休日はどうでしたか。Um, yeah, today was Fukuoka. It was the third show of the 10th anniversary tour,、uh, and this is our third installment of our 10th anniversary tour update. Our tattoo. This is your third tattoo. And I、uh, hope to give you more tattoos throughout this whole year. Now, Fukuoka, which is in Kyushu, it was mentioned、um, in our last little episode,、uh, it has a special place in my heart. It was the second show that I attended.、Um, the first time I really went a little bit further than I would have、um, for, for anything when I was in Japan, and it was for Bandmate. And it's one of those things where you realize. As you're doing this, man, Bandmate really kind of makes you do stuff you <laughs> and go further and farther than you ever thought you would. So,、uh, that second show, I took the Shinkansen, watched the show, and I came back because my dog was waiting for me.、Uh, it was a really fun show. Psyche had actually forgotten the second,、uh, forgotten to sing along to the second verse for I Can't Live Without You. And she got back on track, but I. Was kind of caught off guard that, that had happened, but I remember she was so passionate that night. And that particular year, Akane was coming out and dressing up in all these different,、um, all this different attire. And that night, she came out dressed as a foreigner, a blonde foreigner. And I can't remember what she said, but she had on this fake plastic nose, blonde hair, was just dressed looking like I don't know what, but I was very amused by that. But the second time I went was a year after 2019. And in 2019, that was also a special year.、Uh, that was December 7th, 2019. And it was really cool because that night I got to meet,、uh, sorry about that, I got to meet、uh, Michael Barber for the first time.、Uh, we kind of slowly started getting to know each other. And because of him and a ticket that he had given to me, I was able to, able to go up close. I got to talk to Miku and Saiki because they asked if there were any foreigners. And I'm like, LA, LA. And they had just come back from such an amazing、uh, few shows、uh, back in the States that year. So I talked to them, and、uh, Misa was clapping because I was from LA, and that made me really, really happy. But anyhow, now as far as prior to the show, not too much. Well, the show itself、uh, was at a venue called Drum Logos. And Drum Logos has a capacity of a thousand. And with Drum Logos, it's interesting because outside they have these,、uh, this panel to handwrite、uh, who the guests are. So it's always kind of interesting. And across the street is this、uh, couple of basketball courts. And I don't know why, but it always reminds me of White Men Can't Jump. If some of you guys know that reference, it might be a bit old for some of you.、Uh, now, prior to the show,、uh, Saiki was wearing the Gotochi shirt.、Um, and Gotochi is just local, like that you know, region. And it was、uh, yellowish orange with, I think,、uh, either a blue or black font. I'm not quite sure. And I, I can look at it later. Other than that, No fans、um, signed merch that I saw this time around on Twitter.、Um, I did see some fan had actually made churro. It said band made. And I don't know how they did that, but、um, man, I want some band made churro、uh, when I go to band made land and I can go on all these different band made rides.、Um, yeah, man. That, that's going to be the goal, not world domination, an amusement park、uh, for Bandmade. All right, now I actually want to show you just,、uh, we'll get to the set list. I want to show you actually the 2018 set list. Okay, so here's 2018. And here's an idea of what songs were playing at that time because, you know, world domination had come out that year, Start Over had been released that year with Screaming. And. I mean, from, from that catalog with World Domination, Just Bring It,、uh, Brand New Made, and on back to New Beginning. 
some good songs. I mean, there's songs on there that we may never ever hear again live. So I find myself fortunate to have been able to have attended that show. Now next, 2019. Now 2019, we had Conqueror. So Conqueror was thrown in there and they also were throwing back, like calling up some really random songs. So you actually got the B-side. You had uh, Matchless Gum and Unfair Game that night at uh, Fukuoka. And I know a lot of you, uh, Matt Brown, I <laughs> know you were the man who was always, always um, saying, Matchless Gum, Unfair Game, uh, S tier, why is it not played more? Well, that night it was. Now, tonight though, um, yeah, oh, again, so that was an amazing night. Now, here's uh, Fukuoka from tonight. Here uh, is the whole list. And if you look, they actually threw in two new songs. They threw in Isle, which I know a lot of you want to hear live, and Moratorium, which is an oldie, but one of the best. Um, absolutely one of the best. So that, uh, this night's set list is also, I think, I don't know. Pretty amazing. Now I'm gonna actually put up. Uh, here's Kumamoto's. Okay. Here is Kagoshima's. And here is Fukuoka's. Well, yeah. I'm not quite sure how it's gonna look. <laughs> but if you take a look, the second half, um, pretty much from number ten and on, it's been the same all three nights. Uh, now, Kumamoto was very special because it was uh, Miku's hometown and they started off with the one, two, three, Miku. But in terms of things that have been changed up, not too much. So what I'm curious about is whether this is the set list and this is how it's going to be for the whole year, which I'm pretty sure it's not. Um, or if they're going to change things up quite a bit in Kansai. And so you're going to have this whole section of the set list, which may be the same for the Kansai shows, but you're also going to have room to play around with. And that seems to be what they're doing. So here is what it's been. And I am, again, excited to see what it's going to be. Next month will be in my region. They will be playing. Um in Kobe, in Kyoto, in Osaka. I am hoping to attend all three shows and I'm very very excited um, and very very poor so but what are you gonna do? Just eat less I guess which is kind of happening. That's it for now uh, with these three shows wrapped up that means that there's gonna be a month break and I'm not quite sure what the maids are going to do within that month. Next, oh, actually this week, it's Sunday. This week, April 1st, what's going to happen? I don't know. I just don't know. Anyhow, I'm going to stop because I'm mumbling now and it's late. So thank you so much, guys. You've been awesome. You are always awesome. Thank you so much. And we will see you when we see you. So this has been our third tattoo. Thank you and bye-bye.